Hello, my name is Dr. David Robert Miller. I'm a hand upper extremity specialist at Town Center Orthopedics. I've been in practice here for 23 years now. I'm board certified in orthopedic surgery as well as hand surgery. Oftentimes patients present uh, to the office uh, with different complaints. A lot of times patients think they have carpal tunnel. Their primary uh, uh, complaint is hand pain. And in the two most common conditions that I would say that could be misdiagnosed as carpal tunnel um, frequently are uh, tendonitis and arthritis of the wrist and hand in different various areas. For all these conditions, uh, carpal tunnel, wrist arthritis, or hand tendonitis, they all present with pain in the hand. And the patients will often, um, you know, uh, go onto the internet and look up uh, sources or causes of hand pain. And carpal tunnel is, of course, one of the number one causes, probably one of the most common causes of nerve compression in the hand. Uh, the way we differentiate those is, again, by a good physical examination, along with a good history. So carpal tunnel, again, the primary presentation with carpal tunnel and the things that I look for on history are nocturnal symptoms, night pain. Usually arthritis in the hand does not uh, present in that manner. Uh, arthritis will typically have the primary complaint of pain with use. So pain in the basal, like basal or thumb arthritis is a common source of uh, pain and a common area of, uh, of where we find arthritis. And the patients will usually complain of pain with usage of the hand, grasping, pinching. As with carpal tunnel, again, night nocturnal pain, numbness and tingling is, is common with a nerve entrapment uh, such as this, uh, whereas numbness and tingling is not a common uh, component of uh, arthritis pain. And tendonitis can differs from carpal tunnel in that tendonitis, say uh, a trigger finger, for example, that'll present oftentimes with stiffness of the finger or mechanical symptoms such as locking of the fingers and flexion and popping. Um, and uh, the tenderness and, and pain are, are usually uh, present on examination directly over the base of the fingers. Um, and these patients will typically have pain with, uh, with, with um, active use of their hands. Carpal tunnel also can have pain with active use of the hands, but again, with carpal tunnel, you're going to have, along with that, nocturnal symptoms oftentimes, numbness and tingling in the fingers, uh, sometimes weakness and dropping things, which can occur with both again, uh, but uh, this is a pattern more often seen with uh, nerve entrapment. Okay, the treatment of carpal tunnel, typically if a patient comes in and there's, uh, they have classic findings of carpal tunnel and physical exam and indeed proves that to be the case, uh, we'll often implement treatment simply with a wrist brace at night. So nighttime splinting is very effective in early carpal tunnel and can alleviate symptoms in most cases. Um, once patients have, uh, we'll have them fall up in four weeks. If they have significant relief of their symptoms, no further treatment is necessarily uh, is necessary. Um, after, uh, if they come back in four weeks and they report that the splints have helped, but not significant, uh, they still have significant symptoms such as breakthrough numbness or tingling during the day, um, I'll offer them uh, oftentimes a cortisone shot, and that can provide significant relief. Um, doesn't always cure the condition, but can keep the, the symptoms at bay and help the patient to function better for some period of time. When all conservative measures fail, um, we have a surgical option such a, that we use um, is called a carpal tunnel release. We can do that under local um, uh, um, with the patient wide awake during that procedure. And uh, that procedure takes uh, two to three uh, minutes to do. Um, with the compression of that nerve, most of their symptoms that come and go are alleviated immediately. Any uh, significant symptoms have been for a long time, like static numbness, meaning numbness is always there. Usually it takes some time to get better, but it gets better over time. 